If you like our videos, please like and subscribe. <laughs>
Okay, as you can see, I've got one side off. We're going to reuse this bolt to put the new bracket for the sumo spring onto where the very place that I took this bump stop off. I'm going to go ahead and throw a little penetrating oil on this bolt. Well, I've got it out, move it up just a little bit. Okay, as you can see, I've got the new bracket on there. So I'm going to go ahead and remove these two bolts out of the sumo spring. And... They've got to... Uh, Oh, I should have put them in first. Bag on it. Oh, I gotta loosen that up. Gotta loosen that up. Until they fit. Live and learn. Okay, don't do like I did. Make sure you put them bolts down through there before you tighten that up. Or you're gonna have to loosen it back up like I did. Okay, I've got it started now. Now I'm gonna to have to go up on top and tighten the two bolts up on top. Now, the video I watched, he had a ratchet wrench and I don't, so it's gonna take me forever. Actually, most of my time tonight was spent gathering tools. I'll get this side done. So it won't take as long. Once you get these on there, they're not going anywhere. So I got the shock on Okay, the top's on and secured. Give you a little tip, you might wanna have a set of uh, ratchet wrenches. It just takes a little longer to put them on with the regular wrench, and the top takes a 14 millimeter. Okay, I've got the bottom bracket on here now. One side anyway, I'm tightening up. Like I said, if you got one of these, you either got to have a lot of money to pay somebody to work on them, or you got to do it yourself. Ugh. Ugh. We'll drop the other ones through. These has got square. They hold theirself. I don't know where my camera's at. See, they hold yourself from the top. Okay, get this bracket on. This is actually easier than the top bracket. These are lock nuts on the bottom, by the way.
be ready to spend about, I don't know, if you got tools like me, a little longer. Like I said, if you got that ratchet wrench for the top, it's much easier. I would say you better spend about, plan on three hours anyway. And if you got carpal tunnel syndrome like me, your fingers go to sleep. <sighs> Makes it harder yet. Okay, like I say, once these got weight on them, they ain't going anywhere. I've got my jack all the way up right now. So, um, it's a little bit cockeyed there, but I'm pretty sure it'll go down in there just fine when I take my jack down, so we'll see. I'll take it down slowly to make sure. Let me stick you in here now with my jack's pretty much uh, raised up. Pretty. Let's see those praying. Guess I'll have to get the camera down here like this so I can get a side view. There. She went down in there just like she should. So one side done. Again, it's going to be about three hours. I'm probably not going to film the other side. That's what it looks like putting on some most things. I'm also going to do a cheap handling fix uh, while I'm under here messing around and get my oil changed. I may not do the oil this weekend, but I'm going to do the cheap handling fix. That's your Simo's Spoon video.